What's up, fam? Welcome back to the channel. So, guess where we are today? I am in Columbia, South Carolina. By the time you see this, this will be a few days past. But we're about to go into U.S. Foods. I don't know. Let me know. Let me know if you have a U.S. food in your area. Do you shop there frequently? Because you don't have to have a membership. At least the last time I was in here, you didn't have to have a membership. And that was a year ago. So let's go in prayerfully. There is no membership needed. Otherwise, I will be turning around. Look at some of the prices. Grab me a box of gloves. And jet on out to my next store. This used to be one of my favorite places to come when we owned our child care center. I would buy things in bulk and definitely save money on shipping. This the case price. This is the freezer section in here. You can buy cabbage in the bags like this right here. I don't see a price though. You got broccoli, $40 for a case. Garlic, $17 for that bag right there. You got a case of frozen Salmon fillets for $91.59. That is 20 pounds. You get 10 32 ounce bags in a box. So if you're interested in crab, you can get clusters. That is $64.99 for a case. Five eight ounce bags are in there. You can get this big old thing of, it's a 7.5 pound container of Old Bay for $48.89. They have your frozen vegetables. Anything that restaurants sell, they have in this store. So they have these little mac and cheese things here for $7. They're like tater tots, but it's supposed to be mac and cheese inside of it. So this is what I was looking for. This is like an appetizer. It's the sweet battered corn in here. Show you the bag right here. And it's $5.99. So this is gonna be a short video, but you get the gist of what's all in here. Everything that a restaurant would need, small or big, you can get it out of here. You have large canned goods over here um, for, it says eleven fifty nine for these pineapple chunks, but the value ones over here are $9.99. And you have your flour, any kind of cups, straws, plates, carriers that you need, you can find in this store. They even have candy in here. Now, I'm looking for the gloves. Um, when I used to have a child care center, I would come in here and buy my gloves if I didn't get them online. When the prices went up online, they were still a little bit cheaper in here. But since 2020, prices have gone up period for any kind of gloves. You have the box of toilet paper in here. $44 for that one. Paper towels down here, $31 for 30 rolls. All your little taco stands and stuff like that. Serving trays. If you're looking for some huge pots, things of that nature, 
There's some cleaning supplies. You can definitely find it in here. Measurers, huge ones, metal ones, um, anything you would need. Honestly, if you were having a party or if you were doing whatever, you have your coffee pots and everything. You even have your pictures over here where you know they make their drinks in. Huge stock pots over here. Lids are separate. Stock pots are anywhere. This one is $62 and then $31. And then even bigger ones over here for $113. Here's a huge wok. Like the camera's not even doing it justice as to how big this thing is. It's $90. You got your plastic and your paper bags, your to go trays. This would be a nice big bowl to make some dough in. $43. And the gloves are cheaper in here. These are powder free. Vinyl gloves for $3.79. You have your lighters, your thermometers for your refrigerator, for your freezer, etc. I know we used to have to have one, we have to have one in our oven. We had to have one in our freezer, refrigerator, when we had child care center. $23 for these sauces, $20.12. They have the really big ones. I haven't even seen these flavors in the store, honestly. The garlic parmesan, that would probably taste good on some wings. You can tell I'm hungry. See you in the next video.